Holy crap, how did I walk past all this stuff right at the front of the store? Tons of Halloween stuff. I am so excited right now. Right, guys it's hot it's raining it's muggy but we are in the mood for some halloween so we are going in to this home goods store right here on hilton head island in south carolina because i have heard many a tale that they already have halloween stuff where is all the halloween joy ghosts and skulls and halloween toys i just walked by some chick stocking the shelves when i was singing that and she looked at me like what in the world Ooh, and who is this little Halloween friend right here? Look, it's called a heat and hug microwave and removable microwave my removable belly. Okay, he's like a trick or treat friend. I don't usually put my friends in the microwave, but apparently that's where this guy is going. Okay, this stuff is cool just to start. Look at this. It's a haunted house soap dispenser. How awesome is that? That's 10 bucks. That is sweet. It's got ghosts and pumpkies and a little spider friend up there in the window. And look at this one. This is a candy corn scented hand wash. Look, it's Halloween candy inside a pumpkin. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. Look at this. We got a black cat soap dispenser and a pumpkin with a skull face on it. How cool is that? What is this sparkly fellow here? Look, we have Ray Dunn Hocus Pocus hand lotions. That's pretty cool. And look at these back here. It's more hand wash. This is awesome. Look, it's called Happy Ghost. And this one has bats on it. What is this? It's like a Halloween gnome with long braids. A Halloween ball. Halloween hand towels. These are cool, man. You could decorate like your whole bathroom and or kitchen. Look at this hand soap. It's called Booyah. Holy crap. How did I walk past all this stuff right at the front of the store? Tons of Halloween stuff. I am so excited right now. Look at these awesome ceramic Halloween trees. Those are so cool. And they got purple light bulbs. And look at this guy, it's a gnome, a Halloween gnome with a pumpkin on top of a pumpkin stack. And what is this? It's like a witch. And then we got trick or treat books here with a witch hat. There's another Halloween gnome hiding back there. Okay, this is totally cool. It's a Halloween snow globe, but it looks like it has little black flecks in it. Let's try it. They might even be like tiny little bats. Look at that. How awesome is that? It's like a billion little black bats flying around the haunted house. Here's another one with a black cat and a hat, a witch hat. All right, let's get this one going. Oh, it's on books. All right, let's see what this one does. Oh my gosh, this is so awesome. Look at that. Look at the cat's eyes. <laughs> and look at this ghost here, a little ceramic ghost with a pumpkin. I like his top hat and here's a button for this little haunted gingerbread house back here. Ooh, it lights up inside, can you see that? Yeah, that is pretty cool. All right, let's see. We have electric Halloween candles, witch's brew, what is this? This must be like a real candle. We have the little electric tea candles like you put inside your carved pumpkins. What is this? It's string lights. It's like little Halloween pumpkin bells or something. A boo truck with ghosts in the back. Look at the face on this one. <laughs> He's like, Mom, are we there yet? And what is this? It's like a potion bottle. Oh, it's missing a leg. But it's a potion bottle that has eyeballs in it. Okay. And it's a snow globe. Look at this. You can't tell that they're eyeballs. Oh yeah, you can, there you go. You can see that they're eyeballs. How cool is that? 
Oh my gosh, they have so much cool stuff here. Look at this. It's like, I don't know if you'd call these skeleton keys, but it's a garland of Halloween keys. We got this little ghosty friend over here saying boo. And then a skeleton right here. Look how he's wearing the striped witch hat. Excuse me, sir, did you steal that from a real witch? I love things like this. It's just a tin black cat, but I love the look of that. That's such a classic Halloween decoration. And look at this mystic moon candle. We got skull candles here. I think these are, yeah, these are the electric candles. Those are cool. That would illuminate the whole skull on there. That would be super spooky. We have this little stuffed skeleton fellow here. Hello, friend. And look at this uh, skull over here. It's It looks like beads, but it's not really. And he has sparkly eyes. You say witch like it's a bad thing. Okay. Pocus, pocus, I need wine to focus. Wait a minute. Look behind here. Look at the stack of skulls. Hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil. Here's a glass skull. That looks pretty cool, actually. It looks like pearl. And he's got a mohawk. And then look at this one over here. Look at the lace in the eyes. And then there's like a black flower on her head. These are cool wine flutes that are being held by a skeleton hand. That is pretty cool, only the flute part is loose in there. I wonder if that's supposed to be. Maybe it's not a flute. A flute is a wine glass. But maybe that's just meant to have like a flower in it or something. Oh my gosh, they have so much cool stuff in here. Look at this skull back here that is like overlaid with lace. That is so spooky looking. Spooky skull aroma diffuser. That is cool. <laughs> and it comes with cinnamon. Kind of surprised it doesn't come with like a pumpkin spice or something. Oh my gosh, I love all the skeleton stuff. Like these down here are glass skulls. I want to pick one up so bad, but they're glass and I don't want to break one. But look at the skeleton lady here. <laughs> Oh my gosh, and look at this one. Look at the dress. It's like a half two-toned dress going up to her face. Now, I gotta take a look at her. Look at the hat she has on. That is so funny. She's like, are we going to the ball later? I cannot get over how cool these things are. Look at this, it's skeleton couples. Look at this one here. It's like a bronze and gold. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Look at that. <laughs> that is so awesome. How much is that? That is 20 bucks. That is so cool. And look at this one over here. I gotta pull it forward so you can see the details. Look at the dress. It's like a, a gold lace dress. She's holding a bouquet of flowers because maybe they just got married. Look at that. I love that so much. Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna touch that one back there because I just don't want to knock these things over, but that is so cool. And look, we even have a snow globe here. Moonlight Manor. I think it's supposed to say Moonlight, but they forgot the T. All right, let's do it. Yeah, look at that. How cool is that? Sparkly. We got the Hocus Pocus sign here, the Trick or Treat sign back there. What is this? Oh my gosh, this stuff gets better and better. Look at this. His eyes light up. That is so cool. It's like a book with a skull and roses popping out. Oh, and a raven picking at his head. Spooky sign made with beads. And then a giant gold skull over here. What in the heck is this coming out of his head? Skull shot glasses. Look at that. I would use that for little candle holders. That is really cool right there. The light would come right out their eyes. Oh my gosh, look at these little spooky fellows. We have a ghost with a pitchfork. He's like dressed up as a devil for Halloween. Look at his tail. <laughs> oh my gosh. And then we got this guy here. What is he? He's like, maybe he's a devil that's dressed up like... Oh no, he's not a devil. He's just a little Dracula guy. Look at those fellows, they're like little trick-or-treaters. Here's another couple ghosty fellows here with their little boo signs. What is this? 
it's like a Mickey Mouse bowl. There's two of them, black and orange. Oh, it could be like um, chips and dip. Put your chips in a big bowl and your dip in the two little ears. Oh my gosh, look at this guy. I love this so much. This is such classic Halloween. Look at his head. Look at how his head is so perfectly round. He's like a mummy, and he has his pumpkin friend, and he even wrapped the pumpkin friend up like a mummy. Look at that. That is so hilarious. I love it so much. We've got witches with ghosty friends. Look at this skull back here. They have so many awesome skulls in this store. Look at his eyes. I want to I wanna get just like a regular skull and paint it like that. Maybe put some sparkles on and stuff. That would be a cool project. And look at this one here with the uh, the flowers, the multicolored flowers. We've got like a ghosty cookie jar. Look at his face. That is too funny. And tin trick-or-treat bags that you put lights in. Actually, let me see here. Yeah, they have the little electric tea candle lights in there. So all you have to do is turn it on. And look, there's giant ones back here with skulls cut in them. And then big ones down here that you could line your pathway with. Oh my gosh, guys, look at all this stuff. So much cool stuff. Let's take a look at it closer. Starting with the wreaths over here. They're all cool, and I like this one up here that says boo, and has the pumpkins and the orange flowers. However, look at this one. <laughs> it's got like red and black roses, and skulls, like laughing skulls all the way around it. We got a giant light up boo sign down here. Skull stacks, drinking skeletons. Those are like the grandpa skeletons that are just sitting on the park bench drinking coffee, feeding birds. Tin haunted houses. You gotta love haunted houses, man. Look at these things. Let me turn this one sideways here. Haunted houses are so cool. They always have like the bats. Bats and things like the spooky scary trees. This one's got sparkly pumpkins on it. More just married skeleton couples. And look at the picture frames here, how they're made out of bones. Those are like metal too. And look at all these black wreaths over here. Like this one looks like it's made of feathers or something. Oh, and there's one down there. That This one's actually black with the feathers. This one looks like it's more like a Man, that looks like green and, and blue. I'm not even sure. More skulls up there. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is too funny. It's like skeleton witches on a broom. The skeletons are flying on a broom. <laughs> skulls with sparkly ravens. What are those guys looking at? Witch boots. I think these boots are probably like a Halloween planter. Like you probably plant a plant in there, put dirt in, and plant some kind of a plant in the boots. Nonetheless, they are awesome. And look at this guy. It's almost like a like a wizard skeleton or something. He's on books, book of poisons, best hexes and charms, spells, and then he's just like just chilling out with his top hat on. Look at these witches. These are too funny. Look at this one. That almost looks like a cartoon witch. And then you got this one up here. Hello, cackly witch. They are like so happy because it's finally the Halloween season. These little pumpkin trick-or-treaters up here, just waiting for the word so they can go out trick-or-treating. And look, we have a black ceramic tree back there, a boo sign with ghosts. And then, what did I say these are? Oh, like gnomes. Halloween gnomes, like wizards, holding skulls. This is cool. This would actually be pretty easy to make at home. I mean, if you had the right saw, it's just a wooden skeleton, and all the joints are held together with ropes. That is pretty cool. Oh my gosh, look at this trick-or-treat fellow here. He's got a boo hat with ghosts and bats, a pumpkin face. Oh, there's a spring on it. I'm not gonna try to make his head bob but I bet it does. And then he's holding a bowl that you would fill with candy so trick-or-treaters can come up and get their candy one piece at a time. Look at these ghosts, what the heck? Why do they have like a piece of newspaper on them? Guys, I love so much that all these Halloween characters in here are so smiley and jolly and so happy 
that Halloween is here. Look at this guy. He's smiling and he has a giant spider on his face. I would not be smiling. Smiley pumpkins, smiley ghosts. Look at this guy. Eat, drink, and be scary. Look at, that. Look at the eyelashes on that guy. And then we got this skeleton fellow over here. Oh my gosh, there's just so much. Look at this guy back here, this boo ghost. And he's holding up two pumpkins. Like, he's so happy that it's finally Halloween that he's like, yes, everybody gets a pumpkin. And this guy's like, can I have another? Oh my gosh, guys, I cannot believe how much awesome Halloween stuff they have. When I first walked in, I didn't think there was going to be very much, but holy crap. <laughs> Look at the skeleton dancing ballerinas. That is too funny. What is going on with this guy? See no evil skeleton candle, but he's peeking. He's peeking at the evil. Look at these skeletons down here. They're like carrying a slab of wood that you could put something on, like candles. I bet that would be cool. Put candles on there. Oh my gosh, I just cannot believe how much stuff there is. Make sure that you stick around for the entire video, guys. Because seriously, look at how much Halloween stuff we have to look at. Look at this happy cat fellow here. He's so hilarious with those fangs. And he's got a bat on him. What's it say? Happy Halloween. We got a trick-or-treat. I guess this is a cat. Yeah, because that would be the tail right there. Oh, these are cool. These are Ray Dunn candles. Trick or treat and boo crew. I gotta smell it. So hilarious when people are standing right around watching me do this stuff. Trick or treat candle. Those are so cool. Those are some of my favorite things in the whole store. But look at this guy here. It's a gnome with a Halloween ceramic tree on his head. This witch hat is made completely of these tiny little beads. Like, can you see those? Halloween pumpkin garland. I bet those are made with yak hair. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm such an idiot. Look at this. We got the pumpkin patch down here. Oh, it's a sign for the pumpkin patch. And it's like a couple shovels and a witch's broom. And we got the sign for the haunted house. Look, there's even a black cat on there. And then we have a stack of ghost friends here. Look at the happy faces on the ghost friends. I just love that. What is this? Ghost party. What in the heck is it like? It's a garland. It's a ghost garland. Over on this one, we have more stacks of happy Halloween friends. Look, this is three pumpkins here. And they're so happy. Oh, and there's a, a raven. Lord Raven is on the top. And then we have a ghost. Let's not cover up his happy face. There he is. He's holding a pumpkin and he's sitting on a pumpkin. Here's a happy ghost stack back here. And then another one out here. Of course, this isn't a ghost stack, but this looks like a ghost family. Like they're preparing to go out trick-or-treating. They got their pumpkins. There's the ghost kid, the ghost mom and dad, a pumpkin up here, and they have the pet black cat. What in the heck? I think we looked at one of these over there. It's a light up like gingerbread Halloween house. And these are cool, look. They're like mason jars with pumpkin faces, and they come with the electric uh, little tea lights. That would be awesome right there. Put in a dark room. Oh my gosh, the, the stacks just keep getting higher. Look, we have another three stack of happy ghosts, and then another stack of happy pumpkins, a stack of happy skulls with a raven on top. We got this happy pumpkin fellow down here. And then I love this welcome sign. Look at the skeleton hands on top. It looks like that lights up all the way down the sign. All right, let's go down this aisle. Wait a minute, no, we missed this one over here because there was somebody in it earlier. <gasps> How cool is this? Look at this. It's a light up wicked sign. That is pretty awesome. Orange light bulbs on it. That is totally sweet. They have so many Halloween gnomes this year. Look at this guy. He's like squishy. Sorry, sir, for tickling you. <laughs> what the heck is this? 
W I oh and there's another one that says wicked. See all this stuff is like so packed in here that if you touch it it's gonna fall over. However, hello little happy ghost fellow. Look at these cups. These are pretty cool. These kind of like roll around though. I had a cup of water in one of these in Las Vegas and I accidentally spilled it all over the waitress. Sorry. More skulls peeking out. Yeah, I need to get some skulls and make some of those just as an awesome project. We got a sparkly sequin skull. What is this? It's a light. It's like a lantern that has skulls and bones in it. Okay, what's this say? Broom parking, one hour only. Fangs for the memories. I love this Ray Dunn stuff. Holy crap, look behind this one. Look at those skulls with snakes coming out the eyes. Here's another awesome Ray Dunn thing. Like this is a utensil. Oh my gosh, it's heavy, it's ceramic. But this is for utensils in the kitchen and it says, boo. Yep, Ray Dunn, that is awesome. And if we peek behind here, you can see a skull cookie jar. Did we see this one yet? This gnome with the candy corn looking hat. Sparkly black spooky tree. Look, oh wait, it's got a, uh, a button here. Let's see. Oh yeah, lights up. Orange lights on the spooky tree. More happy ghosty fellows with a bat. I'm telling you, if I had a bat or spiders on me, especially spiders, I would not be happy. What in the world is this? It's a skeleton stretching, getting ready for the big race. All right, look at that. Orange sparklies falling down him. That is too funny. He's ready for the marathon. Jack-o'-lantern fragrance candle. Let's give that one a smell. Mm. <laughs> a witch down here with her skull friend. Look at her eyes. She's so happy that it's Halloween and she gets to have her skull friend. What is that guy? What in the heck? It's like a... I don't even know what you would call that. It's obviously supposed to be Frankenstein's monster because he's got the bolts coming out his head and a green face. Well, what is up with that hair? He's like a hipster monster. And I almost missed this little boo fellow over here. It's a cat in a bubbling cauldron. Like, even the cat is happy to be bubbling in the hot witch's cauldron. I wonder if it includes dead man's toes. Here's another huge stack of happy goblins. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. That's ceramic. Giant pumpkin, ghost friend with a little pumpkin friend back there. Let's see if I can move this. Hold on. There we go. Yes. And then we got another pumpkin and a gnome up there with another happy pumpkin. Oh, now this is cool. Look at this. This is like a solid wood carved trick-or-treat sign. That is pretty awesome right there. $17 for that. I love that. Guys, there's just so much cool stuff in here. Look at this, a potions book. Look at the picture on that. That is classic Halloween. I'll tell you what, I love the animatronics and all the stuff that we see in like Spirit Halloween and Party City, but stuff like this really gets me excited about Halloween. Just a witch with a pumpkin, an awesome fall feel, haunted house, jack-o'-lanterns, ghosts. And look at this, it's another garland with little monsters. I love these so much. Look, we have the uh, the mummy. I guess that's what that would be, a mummy, or maybe it's a ghost, I think it's a mummy. We got Dracula, we got Frankenstein's monster, and the Bride of Frankenstein. That is so awesome. It doesn't even say what this stuff is made of, but I did go to a llama farm once and this lady was making like balls like this out of the llama hair. So maybe it's llama balls. <laughs> All right, look at this one down here. We got a happy pumpkin in Snoopy and Woodstock. Woodstock? Woodchuck. Woodchuck? I don't even know. What the heck is his name? I can't even remember. That is pretty cool though. And look at this one. It's another snow globe or bat globe or whatever you want to call it. Halloween globe trick or treat with a dog dressed up like a cat. All right, let's do it. Yeah, look at that. I love these things. I just want to have a whole bunch of these in my collection. Here's another awesome looking one too. What the heck is it? 
it looks like a boneyard or something in a cauldron. A bones in a bubbling witch cauldron. That's exactly what that is. All right, let's get it going. Look at that. That is so cool. I wish they made sounds. I bet they do. Hmm. Okay, I got it turned on. I can tell there's a light somewhere, but it's not making any kind of sounds or music. Making magic happen. It's like a witch hat cookie jar. Cookies are magic. And look at this sign back here. Go home. <laughs> oh my gosh, here's another one. It's like a witch hand. Did we see this one already? The witch hand, it has eyeballs in it. Look at that. That is so cool. Look at these little happy fellows here, and in a cat with an enormous mouth. He must be waiting for some of those magic cookies. Look at this, home is where the hunt is. And we got Mr. and Mrs. on their honeymoon. Oh, look at these. These are those signs that you set right outside your door. These are awesome. Look, we got spooky. I think they all light up too. Welcome and trick or treat. I think the trick or treat one is my favorite because of the awesome fall halloween -y colors and the candy corn. Let me know if you guys like candy corn. I love candy corn, but a lot of people don't. Look at that spider. Oh, and this is a diff different trick-or-treat one behind it. I like that one too. Oh my gosh, so much stuff. Look at this, more of these garlands, utensil holders. I love classic Halloween stuff like this. Oh, look at this ghost. That's cool, there's a pumpkin peeking out there, a boo bats look at this a mantle scarf it says spooky and you hang it from your mantle like right above your fireplace and look at that with the black candles that looks so spooky oh my gosh guys i am just overwhelmed by all the awesome halloween stuff in the store what in the world is this fluffy fellow hello sir <laughs> I don't even know what it is. It looks like a bat, but it has no wings. He's a fluffy fellow. Oh my gosh, just so much stuff. Look at this guy down here. Happy because he has a Halloween lollipop. This is cool. This is like a skeleton chips and dip bowl, I guess it would be. You put all your chips in here, and then you'd put your dip in there. Potions, brews, and spells. And then, oh, look at this one. I don't know if you put a candle on top of there, but probably. Those are, I think, solid glass. And what is this? Probably another, yes, it's another garland. Did we see this one yet? With all the pumpkins in there? We got Mouse's Golden House over here. If you don't know, that's a very old book that if you find it, it's worth a lot of money on eBay. This is a Halloween haunted house pumpkin. Oh, and he lights up, can you tell? Yeah, you can see the little light in there, the tea candle. There was an old woman who lived in a shoe and then it was haunted. I think this is a cookie jar, is it? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna pull too hard, I wanna break it, but it is, the hat comes off the pumpkin and it's a cookie jar. Look, we got witch, this is made out of beads. Look at this guy, he's got a rose in one eye. Everything this year is Hocus Pocus. The new Hocus Pocus movie is coming out very soon, guys. I cannot wait to see it. Look, it says Love Potion. Wait a minute, look at this little fellow. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this guy so much. I can't tell what he is. He looks like a candy corn who's dressed up like a mummy. What the heck? He just looks like he wants to be your new best friend. Look at this, there's so many different kinds of, of little garlands and stuff here. Look, we have ghosts, and then we have like, I think these, what are these? I don't even know what those are. I don't think those are garlands, but they're more awesome ghosts made the same way. And then there's this pack. This is so cool. I love these so much. Look at this. Look at the monster, and the ghost, and the pumpkin, and then there's purple bats. God, guys, I love Halloween so much. Why, yes, I am a handsome devil. And there's even more. What is this? This is like little zombies, I guess. Little zombie monsters, and there's more ghosts there. Look at all these awesome Halloween Ray Dunn coffee mugs or hot chocolate, if you're a hot chocolate person. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. I actually have a big orange one. I think it says spooky. 
that my son got me uh, last year or two years ago or something. Look at this. Creepy, spooky season, bewitched. Oh my gourd. <laughs> Boo to you. Boo to you. Candy coma. Hello fall. More booze, please. Ghoul's Night Out. I love that green. Look how cool that looks right between the orange and the black. Boo to you. Ghoul girl. Happy. Trick. There must be a treat somewhere. Creepy. Potion. Apple cider. Oh, I cannot wait to have apple cider in donuts. Hocus pocus. I might have to get this. Look. How cool is this? It's orange on the inside. That is so cool. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this may be the best one in the whole place. Look, this is totally mine. You're so corny. Look at this one. I don't know what color this is. It's like a gray autumn vibes. And then we got this awesome one right here. Tis the season to be spooky. That is awesome. Pumpkins and black cats. Oh my gosh, I almost missed two of them down here. Here's one that says, hello fall, and it's white. And then this one says, fall y'all i'm not a big gnome person but these are really cool i just love how they look like candy corns <laughs> and what in the world is this i'm in love with that candy corn cups look at the jolly faces on those two they're such big cups too you could have like golden grams or booberry in them Look at this little Ray Dunn container. It just says spooky and it has little pumpkins on it. It's the great pumpkin Charlie Brown tumblers. Oh man. All right, let's head down this aisle here. Look at this deadly poison. I think that's another cookie jar there. Yeah, those tops are on so tightly. Look at this ghost fellow here. Look at his face. He's so squishy. Look, the tag even says, hey, boo. Fabulous. Trick or treat tunes. Hmm. Don't mind if I do. Work. Crap. It must not have batteries because it doesn't work. Here's a try me button on this crystal ball, though. Oh, is that all it does? spinning around in there. It looks like it's supposed to be like throwing something up in the air, but it's not. Candy corn mug set. Look at that. It comes with spoons that have a little pumpkin on top. What the heck is this? It's dog toys. Look at this. Franken slime, bat elixir, and spider cider. Devil gnome with no eyes. And then we have dancing skeletons. Look at this, what in the world? That's supposed to be like the Marilyn Monroe skeleton, I guess. More snow globes here. Let's see if we can check them out. A skull with Lord Raven on his head. Okay. Yeah, oh, and that one is little bats. Look at that, can you see them? They're tiny little bats. Let's do that one more time. That was cool. The other ones you can't really tell, but this, you can definitely tell it's bats flying around. And then the motorcycle couple. Okay, let's see what's in this one. Yeah, that's just black sparklies, but how cool is that anyway? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Under the fabulous pillow is another one I haven't seen. Candy corn garland. I am loving these garlands. Here's a fortune teller. Um, oh, okay, here's a try me button. Ooh. That is pretty cool, look at that. It lights up purple, very purpley. And right beside that is another mummy. Look how he has his hands up, like he's trying to scare whoever's coming in the house. Big mouth ghost waiting for magic cookies. These must be salt and pepper shakers. Yeah, oh my gosh, look at the faces. I love that. <laughs> to death, till death do us part. Okay. Let's see what this one does. Yeah, same thing. I wonder why more of them don't have bats. That's cool, but I love the ones that have the little bats. Halloween home. What the heck is this? I don't even know. It must be like a blanket or something. 
this little guy here that's apparently a light up candy bowl and then look at this you got the spooky sparkly trees with the pumpkins on them i don't see any kind of a button to light them up though happy halloween gnomes and look at the happy spiders there's three of them what the heck do you do with these guys are they happy they don't even have mouths so how do i know they're happy Look at these giant stacks of skulls here. We got a silver one and a gold one, and it looks like their eyes probably light up. Look at this ghost here, and then this skeleton guy. Like, they're both looking up. Like, what are they looking at? Oh my gosh, we got the spooky tree candles with pumpkins hanging, and there's a witch on there. And what is this, the same thing? No, this is a different kind. Oh, I guess it is. This is just the back with the haunted house. Ooh, we got the sparkly owls. Oh my gosh, look at this witch up here. Okay, we got the black cat. We got the super happy witch with the crystal ball. She's lounging in a chair. All right, let's see if we can use this button here. And Oh, <laughs> look at the eyes on the cat. Is that all it does, though? I can't believe that's all it does. That's still cool, though. Look at those spooky cat eyes. Look, we got another Halloween snow globe with a witch upside down. It's the Wicked Witch of the West upside down in the bubbling cauldron. All right, let's get it going here. Look at that. Do any of you guys collect these things? I want to know. I want to know how many you have and show them to me if you have a channel. Let's pull the happy couple out of here and do this one. Yeah, there it goes as they roll away just married and this one actually winds up so let me see if i can get it going we'll see what it, kind of music it plays okay there we go i have no idea what the song is but it works look at this awesome little spooky scene down here i love the colors in this you got the orange house the haunted house in the background like a silhouette you got all this down here and then pumpkins, a black cat, a yellow tree. That is so cool. Oh, it's got a button on it too. Hold on. Okay, let's see what it does. Oh, <laughs> that is awesome. That's cool. I like how it lights up the houses. I like this pumpkin cookie jar too. That's also a Ray Dunn. You can tell by the lettering on there. And then look at this one down here. We might have seen this one already. Skulls and bones. You could literally just make cookies that were shaped like skulls and bones and keep them in there. Look at this pumpkin candle here. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. When I was little, I had a pumpkin candle that was very much like this. And my sister had a camera, and I had never used a camera before. I wanted to take a picture so bad with that camera. She made me give her my pumpkin candle in trade to take a picture with her camera. And then she made me take a picture of her holding my pumpkin candle. <laughs> my heart was broken. Oh my gosh, the haunted shoe house has a button. Oh, listen. Sounds like laughing and thunder and then the, the windows up here are flashing. Oh my gosh, look at this mummy jar. I love this guy. I bet you put like candy or cookies or something in there. You couldn't put very many, but that is so cool. I love his green eyes. He reminds me of Mad Balls from the 1980s. There were toys called Mad Balls. You'll have to look them up. They are so cool. I'm going on eBay to buy some. And look at this big mouth pumpkin over here. Look at his eyes. That is like a classic Halloween thing there. Some more ghost garlands down there. And look, I just noticed he has teeth. This pumpkin has teeth. And look, peeking out from behind here is a big mouth Frankenstein. This store has so many cool things. I just can't believe it. And look at this ghosty friend dressed up like a pirate. He's dressed up like Smee. Oh my gosh, there's a green fluffy fellow back there. Okay. Oh, okay. Down this aisle, it looks like it's mainly more of like the decorative glass pumpkins and things like that look at this one it says october 31st that's pretty cool give thanks that's more of like a thanksgiving thing look at this little pumpkin stack this guy on top is goofy 
this guy is just kind of jolly and this guy's like what in the world why am i on the bottom of these two <laughs> a lot of the stuff in this aisle over here is more just like fall decor but it's still cool like look at this squirrel friend holding a pumpkin this is more like all thanksgiving type stuff over here which is cool anyway but we just want to see mainly the halloween stuff right now what is this macker i thought these were crabby patties they're pumpkin pumpkin flavored macaroons hmm never had those chocolatey mix halloween candy i bet some of these are crunchy too little eyeballs and they're wrapped like pumpkins probably little monsters and stuff here's just chocolatey eyeballs look at that cat oh look at this individually wrapped um little monsters and pumpkins and ghosts that looks pretty cool we got chocolatey skulls here Day of the Dead chocolatey eyeballs. Oh my gosh, guys. I think we have officially been down all the aisles. So much cool stuff here. I can't believe it. Wait, what is this? Halloween two-color pasta. That reminds me of Jack Skellington. And then down here we have Halloween pumpkin shape pasta. How cool would that be as macaroni and cheese? Oh my gosh, it's like never ending in here. They have tons more here. Look at this, witch's brew, is that a cup? Yeah, like that's a little mug. One of those that kind of rolls though. More Ray Dunn stuff here, Hocus Pocus and Boo. Let's see, what do we have here? Witch Please, that's another mug. Uh, shot glasses, I guess. Popcorn bowl here. Nightmare Before Christmas, that's cool. Here's Disney Halloween cups. Oh my gosh, they just have so much. Look at that skull jar back there. What does this mug say? Fall, y'all, we did see that. Oh, let's see, look at this. What does this say? Boogie, okay. <laughs> Witch and Famous, Jack O'Lantern. Uh, let's see, cookie jars. More stuff over here, look at this. I just love this Ray Dunn stuff. Spooky. That's like a, uh, I can't even think of what you call it. You make bread in it or a meatloaf. What is this? I guess you put the, these are like toothpicks, party picks. Okay, Halloween party picks. We got treat bowls, baking cups here. The witch is in. What is this? It's another Ray Dunn, a treats container. That's ceramic and heavy. Look at these jolly fellows. <laughs> and down here I noticed they had the great pumpkin uh, peanuts trick-or-treating bowls. You could have popcorn in those. Oh my gosh, look at this. I know a lot of you are going to like this. The Bake Shop. Silicone baking mat, cookie cutter, and spatula. Look at that. It's like a Ouija board or something. More Halloween spatulas, magic spells, and bewitched. And that's the same one down there. Skull and Bones cookie cutter. Oh my gosh, guys, my battery literally just dropped down to 5%. There is still a whole bunch more stuff in here. So if you have a home goods, go out and check out all the awesome Halloweeniness. Ah, 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 ah!